Welcome to MCCA's Law Firm Diversity Database tutorial on the trend by racial and ethnic group quantitative data chart. To access the Law Firm Diversity Database, navigate to diversitydatabase.mcca.com and log in utilizing your Diversity Database account if you have created one, or click register for free to create an account and utilize your organization's email address. Members of the MCCA community are able to access the full view of data within the database and non-members can view industry aggregate data. If you have issues accessing the database, please email membership at mcca.com. Once you have logged in, you will see this announcements page, as well as a link to the diversity database user guide on the right-hand side. This tool can provide an overview of functionality within the database. To view the 10 main interactive reporting dashboards, navigate to diversity survey at the top. You will see this top bar shows a full and summary category. The full view is available only to MCCA members, and the summary view is the industry aggregate data. We're gonna go ahead and navigate down to quantitative data charts and trend by racial and ethnic group. So for this tutorial, we're gonna focus on 2021 data. On the left-hand side filter, we're gonna go ahead and change this to 2021. For this tutorial as well, I will go ahead and select my law firm. In this case, we'll be titling it MCCA Law. As you're able to see, the current view is on these percentages. These percentages take into account various different categories and parameters that we'll want to disaggregate. For the purpose of this tutorial, we're going to focus on the current demographics of MCCA law. The way to hone in on this is to navigate to category on the left-hand side filter and select law firm demographics. In short, this is the reported headcount for the key attorney group questions for the law firm diversity database. Next, we'll want to check our attorney group filter on the left-hand side highlight associates, equity partner, non-equity partner, now counsel. Total new hires and summer associates are kept out as total new hires may cause double counts based on the attorney that was hired for the specific group that they were accounted for. And summer associates are seasonal hires that we won't factor into our data in the interest of demographic counts. The trend by racial and ethnic group quantitative data chart allows the user to analyze a firm's demographic population and assess it. Now we will look to appropriately filter our diversity identities category on the left-hand side. So you can individually select, or you can go ahead and hit these three dots and hit select all. But what I'm gonna to wanna to do is I'm going to want to remove individual disability, openly LGBTQ, and veterans. Selecting these categories may create double counts based on how individuals self-disclosed as they can be in one or more categories. From here, I will want to make sure that my touchscreen mode is on. Navigating up top below table of contents, there is this drop down. You'll see the second prompt has touchscreen mode on. Currently it is on, as I can see it is green, and I'm able to kind of leave here. Now we can see all our percentages for 2021. We can also take a look at this data and right click and view it here as a data table, which allows us to ultimately export um, still in terms of key percentages. We can take a look at this data and head on back, hitting these three dots, going back to chart. And here on the left-hand side where it says percentage, we can go ahead and change this to end. And here are the reported headcounts. And we can use the same right-click feature with the three dots to head back to the data view. And with this, we have just pulled the 2021 reported headcounts with the filters that we have highlighted. Right clicking through these dots, going back to the three dots, I can hit data. And from data, I can go ahead and export it if this is what I needed. Let's say you need a bit more in-depth information on these counts. So we can go ahead and focus on some attorney categories we might be interested in. Let's choose equity partners specifically. And then let's see how we've been trending the last few years. From a law firm perspective, this feature lets me know, as well as my firm leadership, on how are we doing as an organization. Perhaps MCCA law advertised that we were looking to increase the hiring and promotion of diverse individuals at the firm. So let's go ahead and assume MCCA law announced that part of their strategic goal was to increase the number of African-American Black female equity partners over the last four years. Utilizing these filters on the left, let's go ahead and add those years. Going back a few years to 2018. Let's adjust our gender, women. 
And let's look to remove these different diversity identities. You can also hit this X here, selecting just African-American black. So we're still in our, in our data view. Um, so we can go back to chart. Now that especially that we have an understanding on how to read our data without double counting and take a look. So here we see some steady improvement in the last few years for FCC law. In-house counsel can utilize this tool when looking to find diverse outside counsel, understanding this data is a snapshot and ultimately ask about narrative. Alternatively, law firms can utilize this data to craft their narrative on the progress they have made and the challenges they continue to work on and or to reinforce and validate their hard work in creating a diverse, equitable, and inclusive organization and to prepare to pitch services and stay competitive with other firms. From here, we can go ahead and right click the three dots again and we can download this as an image, PDF, or data. Additionally, we can right click and we can go ahead and take a snapshot and this will save it to our snapshot library. And I can go ahead and put a description. And now I can take this and up top, head over to my storytelling feature and utilizing this camera function, I can see the snapshots that I've taken. And so I can drag and drop this data. I can add text and images and navigate uh, to different areas, um, ultimately being able to work on it here. Um, and then this allows me to download this uh, as a PowerPoint or PDF or delete it entirely, depending on what I'm looking to do. So thank you for joining us for MCCA's Law Firm Diversity Database Tutorial on Trend by Racial and Ethnic Group by Quantitative Data Chart. If you're an MCCA member that requires further assistance or a non-member of MCCA that would like to engage in MCCA membership, please contact membership at mcca.com.